Hello, welcome to Pursuit of Perfect System. My name is Terry Ellis. I'm an audio reviewer and a DRAC Life calibrator. Welcome to another video of my experience tour of the new Bowers and Wilkins Formation products. Now I'm at Nintronics, the excellent Hi-Fi and AV dealership in Hertfordshire, and they're working together today with Bowers and Wilkins to create a Formation Experience Day. So there's several rooms here with different Bowers and Wilkins Formation products on demonstration. We've got this one here, which is the Formation Bar and the formation base that are used together to create a system that I've just been listening to, and boy, boy, boy. Downstairs we've got the formation duo, which I did a video for already, which is probably up already. That's the two uh, individual speakers that look more like traditional speakers. They look like the actual 805 speakers. I was really impressed with them. And then they've got the formation bridge in with a big system of Bowers & Wilkins 800 speakers of Macintosh electronics. So I'll be getting in there soon for a listen and to make a video. Right then, so let's have a quick chat about the Bowers and Wilkins Formation products that are in this room. Again, we've got the Formation Bar and the Formation Base. Now, the Formation Bar is a beautifully styled, quite large, about the same size as a 65-inch TV sound bar. It's an interesting one, though, because it's got the technologies from this new Bowers and Wilkins Formation range. So it's a wireless product. At the moment, it's connected via Ethernet, but it's a wireless product, and it connects to the other formation products via Bowles & Wilkins' own proprietary wireless technology. So it syncs up very, very easily to the formation base to create a system. It can then sync up to other Bowles & Wilkins formation products around your house to give you multi-room capabilities pretty much at the click of a button. There's a Bowles & Wilkins app, free app that you can download to control these things, but at the moment, and for the listening session I've just had, we've been using Rune because the formation uh, Bowers Wilkins Formation products like the Wedge and the uh, Formation Ones uh, and the Bridge all act as Rune endpoints. So you're able to control your library or your streaming using the Rune app, which actually is a really good app. I've been using it more and more today. I'm getting used to it now. Um, it's, it's very comprehensive and, and, and very be visually beautiful, I must say. So talking a little bit about the Formation Bar, what is it? Well, it's actually semi three speakers in one. We've got six mid-bass drivers in here and three tweeters. So if you think we've got a speaker really on the left, a speaker in the middle, and then a speaker on the right, although that'd be the other way around, obviously. So essentially that gives us an L, C, and R, like what you'd have in a home cinema system. You'd have a right channel, center channel, and a left channel. And because of that, the imaging that it creates is way beyond your expectation, as you're gonna hear in a minute as part of the demonstration. And down in the corner, we've got the formation base, which is a sealed unit. It has dual opposed six inch base drivers. Now, if anybody's seen the Bowers & Wilkins PV1, then they'll probably recognize this design. If you've had an experience of the PV1, I'd say this sounds very, pretty similar to it. It's on a slightly smaller scale, so that's all good. And again, I think the styling of the formation base, I think it's really lovely. I really like the material that they've gone for. And I think the Bowers & Wilkins styling team have really nailed it with this one. You know, talk, so talk is cheap, and I think even visual appeal is cheap unless the products can deliver an engaging sonic experience. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna set the microphones up at ear height at the listening position in Nintronics upstairs, smaller demo room, turn the camera on, play some music, see what you think.
truth but not face it I may hear sound a whisper sacred and profound but turn my head indifferent I may know the world but not say it I may love the fruit but not Cause darling, we 
almost didn't want to stop that. It was sounding so good. Right, so that's, I continue my experience tour of the Lou Patton Wilkins formation products. I cannot believe what I've just been listening to. Obviously, I'm not in the hot seat. The microphones are kind of in a bit of an awkward place, actually, in here for recording. But what... <laughs> I'm a bit of a hi-fi snob in a sense. In a, you know, I thought you know, sound bars will have their place. They'd be good for TV because they'll make the sound kind of much more enveloping and louder, and you're going to get clearer dialogue. Never once did I think I'd ever be able to sit and actually listen to music on a sound bar, and that is exactly what I've just been doing. I've just been listening to all that music, and I didn't want to change tracks. I just wanted to sit and listen and sit and listen. And the reason that is is because. The technology that Bass Wilkins have put into this soundbar means that, let me put this down a second, means that you actually get a pretty big sound stage. Now you get sound in, in Bass Wilkins fashion up here, up above the soundbar, which while it's down here, is kind of like the perfect place really because it would be mirroring the TV, the middle of the TV, uh, the middle of the TV, sorry. It'd be mirroring that in a sense if it was vocals. But from a music point of view, you don't want a sound stage down here, you want a sound stage up here. And some of that music stuff was coming out to the left, right, and stuff was coming out to the left. And you get like a, like a sometimes it's it's kind of soundbar width, the sound stage, other times it's like kind of almost room width in sound stage. And I never expected to get a sound quality like that off the soundbar. And I do think a big part of it is the Bowers and Wilkins formation bass. Is that the right name? Yeah, formation bass and sub over there. You know, having bass that underpins the sound really makes a huge difference to you know, big hi-fi systems, let alone, you know, a soundbar situation. But the bass is coming out of there, that it's a little sub over there with a dual six inch drivers. It's really tight, but kind of throaty and punchy and stuff as well. I was totally not expecting that. And what's crazy and, and brilliant about this system is that the, the subwoofer semi, well, basically integrates itself with this product. You don't have to worry about worrying about crossovers or any of that. Once you sync the subwoofer to the soundbar, it knows it's synced together and it automatically self sets itself up. There's also some dynamic equalization going on in their products. So as you turn them up, the sound rebalances itself. As you turn them down, the sound, sound will rebalance itself, which would be you know, brilliant for people that kind of want to watch stuff late at night and they're struggling to hear it. Well, little things like that will make a really big difference overall. But again, I honestly cannot believe the sound quality that's been coming out of this system. Obviously, this is the second demo I had. The first demo I had was with the Formation Duo, and I really like them. And I was thinking to myself, I wonder if the subwoofer can go with them, and it can. It will sync up with them exactly the same as it does with the sound bar, and I think that will make a really, really big difference for me personally. In fact, I'm going to see if I can set that up a little bit later today to hear that. But this is a killer, killer, killer system. I cannot believe it. I honestly can't believe it. It sounds fantastic. Let me compare, right? So how does this sound compared to the Formation Duos? Obviously the Formation Duos are more transparent. So they are proper speakers, tweeter on top. It gives you it gives things a little bit less haze to the sound. It's clearer. But this is it's disengaging. It's just an enjoyable, engaging listen through all those different music styles. Um, for a soundbar solution, um, this one's killer. This one's absolutely knockout. I genuinely can't believe it. I, mean, I don't have huge amounts of experiences with sound bars, but I did not expect that one to sound anything like that. So, you know, well done, Bowers and Wilkins. You know, they're not paying me to be here. They're not paying me to do this. I'm genuinely, genuinely, genuinely impressed with what they've created here. I love how they look. I think they look beautiful. I made a video I know, a month or so ago. I thought it looked beautiful, really nicely styled. But that's all for nothing, in my opinion, if it doesn't deliver a good sonic performance and this one's delivering one way above my expectations way 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 above so yeah credit where credit's due really cracking products i like the way they all sync together i like the way they work i like the way they, it's a room end point which is what i've been using i don't really use room much i'm just kind of getting my head around how the app works it's a bit cumbersome for me i like things a little, a little bit more simple but the more i'm using it the more i can kind of see the benefit of it as a as a streamer if you're pulling your music from tidal and cobuzz and all those different sources i can see why it's great because it opens you up to lots of new uh, artists and stuff. Um, you know, so it's, a, it's a little bit, that's a learning curve for me. So it, that's why the music selection, I've deliberately kept the same music as well from demo to demo so you can compare the, the two and how they sound. The little, the little subwoofer over in the corner, I was expecting that to be properly wimpy and just kind of just booming, but it's not. That's a pretty good sub. So Bowser Wilkins, yeah, well done. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Hope it's given you a little bit of an insight 
to these products, what they sound like, what they look like, what they're all about. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more of them and hit that notification bell so you get a special prize every time I create a new video. Make sure you visit our website if you haven't before or haven't recently. There's always updates of hot news and stuff for the industry and high fi home cinema going on there. And yeah, hope you enjoyed this one. There'll be loads more. There's always more coming and I'll see you soon. Take care.